we must understand as humans we were created by God and we were created with a function built within us a function to dominate we were created by God with a part in us to rule God made us in his image and God reigns and God rules and God made us with this function he told Adam and Eve he says have dominion over all creeping things anything that's creepy God gave you dominion over and Adam didn't exercise the dominion because the first creepy thing came was a snake and Adam instead of dominion exercising dominion over it he talked to it and well we know what happened next this function to have dominion only works when we are within the realm and protection of the Holy Spirit when we step out from the realm of the Holy Spirit this function doesn't stop it gets abused for example uh, we had another cell group member this week who could not join Skype because he couldn't download Skype to his phone he couldn't find uh, he couldn't download an app to his phone the reason why is because his debit card expired supposedly he goes to the bank next day and finds out that the bank account that he has his debit card he used that debit card outside of state of Washington and the moment he used it outside of state of Washington it immediately blocked him and ever since then he couldn't use it nowhere else some of you have experienced that if you ever went outside of the country and you, you took no cash with you and you took your plastic. Especially, don't ever do that on the honeymoon. Whew, disaster. And so because you go in, you slice it and it blocks you and you know, who are you? Then it calls police and you, look, and you look like you are a thief. And so this particular gentleman, you know, he's saying that my car was blocked because what he did not know is this card that had great privileges it had money it has so many great things but it only worked within the perimeters of the limits that the bank who issued it to him set for him we must understand God gave you dominion but the God who initiated and who released that dominion to you and me he also put perimeters for that dominion and when we step out from the perimeters of the God the what God outlined for us that dominion is like debit card it stops working actually be more correctly it doesn't stop working what we usually do with that dominion is we abuse it let me give you an example anytime you don't have authority over the enemy you will always seek to have authority over another human anytime you don't have dominion over Satan you will always strive to dominate a human I know that I see little kids after Sunday school after Sunday in the parking lot when a child when one child is older by three years than the other child and the other child doesn't obey the older child I will not mention names here and the older child pow in the face slaps it I look at it I was like what are you doing she doesn't listen to me I was like you don't have to kill her I'm thinking what would happen if you give that kid unlimited power Hitler would look like a baby we blame Hitler we blame these great big men who did great bad things in this world and we say oh look at that look how monstrous that same function to dominate is within you and within me the only difference between you is that you never got as much power as he did and if you would you probably could have done worse because outside of God's presence the function to dominate does not stop it gets abused men abuse women men, women they begin to abuse their children or begin to abuse others boyfriends with their girlfriends we begin to abuse the power that God gives us why because that power functions properly when we are in the presence of God and that power is so that we can have dominion over Satan God never gave us dominion over one another what, what do humans do when we dom dominate them they rebel but humans change 
when we love them what do we what do demons do when we dominate them they flee and we're supposed to have dominion over satan and then we will not seek to have dominion over one another today i want to encourage you god has built you with dominion a desire to dominate you want to rule something it's within you and if you're a woman that desire is doubled you want to control something that's a good desire it's made by God but you must understand within the perimeters of God's presence that desire is to dominate Satan rule yourself your mouth not your mom rule your thoughts not your boyfriend or your husband to rule your own spirits not someone else when we step out from the boundaries of God's presence the function to dominate doesn't stop working it gets abused and many people suffer